thank you for watching again my next video in this video I'm just going to tell you that how you can use multiple windows in one platform like for this we use one software scale is called Oracle VM virtual box manager in this virtual box we can run multiple windows like we can uh, use if we install any windows 7 in one computer and we want to use window 8.1 simultaneously and if we have to use windows 10 linux and whatever operating system so we have to download iuso image of that and uh, then after we have to make uh, new windows like this we have to install oracle vm so what we need for the making it iso file of operating system and uh, virtual box box we have to install it then we have to make it run so guys now i'm just going to tell you how you can do it okay we have to click on here new and we don't know what is the name of the window so uh, we are just making it like this when windows 7 so you want to install 8.1 now i'm just going to tell you how you can install 8.1 next how many uh, this is the memory size we can adjust if we have more so we can do it accordingly okay create a virtual hard disk and use existing so we have to click on create and it's saying vmd virtual disk image so we want one image we won't don't want any hard disk and virtual machine this is good for beginners and the dynamic location or fixed size the dynamic location is good it will take any uh, of the things create a file in if we have an image so we can insert it no we don't have when create so here we are going to create it start we clicked on start and now it's loading it's saying what is the startup disk so we have to give them the windows 8.1 this one and you start so now we are installing one windows 8.1 on our windows 7 system now you can see the video here it's installing so it's installing your windows uh, operating system on it and uh, by this you can install it and you can use multiple operating system in one platform this is the main thing i just have to tell you you can use oracle vm now uh, if you know the installation also so you can see here that we have to hit on next and click on install now right so by this what we can do we can make a new file and new virtual machine for our windows operating system okay so uh, thank you for watching my video I will let you know more things and for that virtual box or you can use also uh, machines multiple uh, we have here like uh, we have virtual box here Oracle VM virtual box and virtual machines we have multiple things but this is the good this is the good uh, software and this is a uh, very good uh, software that we can use new uh, new new operating system and we can try it better okay thank you for watching my video and uh, thank you thank you for and please uh, don't forget to subscribe and like my video thank you